Iron Resurrection is easily regarded as one of the best car reality shows in the whole motor trend, formerly Velocity's network. One of the main reasons for its success is that there are no fake rows or ridiculously short time scales for the needed work to be done. The work on cars is done appropriately, and everything is explained in detail so the viewers can understand. All the crew members are extremely talented and does an excellent job on all of the projects. There are also no ridiculous dramas in it and focuses less on it, unlike so many other Cars shows that heavily emphasize even little dramas to increase the ratings. The show first started airing on April 13, 2016, in Motor Trend, and quickly rose in popularity. The entertaining cast members were also the reason why it was so popular, but over the course of these past years, some of those cast members have left the show one by one. The most notable ones were Pampa, Shirty, and Kato. According to reports, Shirty has become a grandfather now and is more interested in spending time with his family. Martin Bros Customs, the business featured in Iron Resurrection, is located in Austin, Texas, which is a three-hour drive from Dallas, where Shorty has his own business. So, instead of splitting his time between the show's business and his own shop, he thought that it was better to just focus on his business and leave the show. This way he would also have more time with his family. In the case of Cato, he also chose to leave the show because of his family, but this time, he left to show support for his wife's change of career, as they are located now in Atlanta, Georgia. He also packed up his business and moved it to Atlanta for Maury's. Additionally, he rebranded his business to a Fuller Moto shop. His move also meant he wouldn't be available for the show in Texas. As for Pampa, the reason for his exit was never really explained by any party, but it's generally believed to be the same as that of Shirty and Cato. However, there are also speculations that he might have left the show because he became tired of his colleagues' spooky jokes every episode. He was known to be easily scared, both on and off the screen, but he always seemed to take those jokes lightheartedly and wasn't really that offended. Additionally, there haven't been any reports of disputes between him and other colleagues, so the real reason for his departure remains unclear. Pampa has stayed out of the public eye since he left the show, and whether he plans to return to the show or not hasn't been decided yet. There is also the matter of Manny being absent from the show, but not even a little detail is available about his leave. His exit remains the most mysterious out of all. Even though such notable and likable people had left Iron Resurrection, the show is still continuing and going on strong. Season 6 of the show just ended on a high note on December 1, 2022, and has left many fans wondering if there will be another season or not. Although the motor trend hasn't made an announcement regarding Season 7 of Iron Resurrection, we can expect the show to get another deserved season, somewhere in the latter half of 2023 or 2024. However, unexpected and controversial things can also happen, and the show might get cancelled because of it. It is highly unlikely that it will get involved in any controversy, as this show doesn't revolve around intense drama, but anything can happen. We just have to hope that doesn't happen. One of the major reasons why the show has been going so strong despite some cast members leaving is, mainly because of the power couple who runs the Martin Bros Customs, Joe Martin, and his wife, Amanda Martin. Joe is a good leader and has an amazing vision. Even though he is the boss, he is really nice to his crew members, making the working environment healthy and not toxic. Amanda is also equally incredible, helping the crews with their projects whenever possible. The show also has a spin-off known as Iron Resurrection Refueled. The interesting thing about this spin-off is that it offers scenes that are not shown in the original Iron Resurrection episodes. It's really nothing more than that. And that's it for the video. What are your thoughts on Iron Resurrection? Are you a fan of the work done by Martin Bros Customs? Do comment on what your thoughts are. Hit the like button and subscribe to our channel if you like the video and stay tuned for more.